All right, now we're going to do question number nine. And this one asks, if you have 156 grams, how many kilograms is that? Well, I don't have milligrams or centigrams or anything like that. I just have grams. Once again, that's my generic unit right here in the center. So if I want to go from grams to kilograms, once again, I need to go three to the left. So grams to kilograms, here's my 156. The decimal is at the end, so one, two, three. And we get 0.156 kilograms. If you wanted to do it with dimensional analysis, then 156 grams. We want the grams to cancel out, so they go in the bottom. And we're going to kilograms, so those go up here. And one gram is going to be, well, I'm going from smaller to bigger, so 10 to the negative 3. Grams cancel. This moves the decimal three times to the right, whether you do it by hand or in the calculator. And both times you get 156 kilograms for question number nine.